All right, well, praise the Lord who's very graciously provided us with this Spanish mackerel for dinner and answer to prayer. And the purpose of this video is to demonstrate how to fillet it with a manual knife. And you could use an electric knife, but Spanish mackerel are one of the easiest fish to fillet uh, with a manual knife, so I prefer it. First cut, just behind the fin, down the backbone, apply the knife over. Second cut, separates the fillet from the backbone. And most of the time when I fillet fish, I separate it from the skin. Uh, but the Spanish mackerel skin is actually preferable to leave it on for grilling. And so since my wife is grilling these tonight, uh, I'm just going to trim out the ribs and trim off uh, some of the fins there. And I'm not going to separate it uh, from the skin for grilling. Another look in the good, good book. Don't let it pass you by. Let the Holy Spirit talk. Walk through the written word. All right, one very nice Spanish mackerel fillet. And let me show you how we would do it if we were going to go ahead and cut it off the skin. The important thing with Spanish mackerel, because the skin is so thin, is you want to hold the knife parallel to the cutting board and just very gently cut it. So you're not pushing down at all and you don't want the knife to be angled down at all. You just start here parallel to the cutting board, keep the knife parallel to the cutting board the whole way and go ahead and cut it off from the skin uh, that way. All right, the second fillet, I usually like to use a cross-handed technique. This allows me to always have the fish's back toward me. So the first cut down the backbone, then work the knife along the backbone. I'm gonna need to trim that up a bit. So the first trimming cut, go ahead and take out the ribs. And then, seems like we got some of the top material here with some bones that help connect the fish to the fins. All right, so go ahead and trim that out. And if we were gonna take it off the skin, I recommend leaving it on the skin for grilling. And, and if you're cooking it right away in various recipes, uh, you might leave the skin on. But if you're gonna freeze it, uh, you'd wanna go ahead and make this cut careful to keep the knife parallel to the cutting board and then you may also want to cut out there's some pin bones in here and uh, there can be a little bloodline in the middle as well that if you're going to freeze it uh, you want to cut that out but uh, that's those parts that might develop a fishy taste uh, if in a freeze and thaw cycle uh, but they're just fine if you're cooking them immediately you just want to be on the lookout for those pin bones in there uh, when you eat it Written in the Word is a message from our God, gonna tell you all about how to get to the kingdom, the good life. Written in the Word is a good, good Word is a message from our God, gonna tell you all about how to get to the kingdom, the good life. Oh, I, I love Jesus. La, 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 la. Jesus.